Hey guys, and welcome to the final peer per view predictions video of this year, which is WWE's Roadblock 2016. Hey, I'm Dave448. Rex And um, we'll be giving you our predictions on every single match. Alright, so first we've got a pre show with this one because we didn't mention the other ones because they uh, they weren't actually on before um like the other ones so pretty sure first off is big cast versus rusev now the reason for this one because um enzo went into like a motor room with him lana yes. and um and um rusev was there and it did not go very nicely for enzo so, <laughs> but since Enzo's buddy, Big Cass, actually got involved because um, he did the tap Rusev, and um, that's. But who do you think is actually going to win this? I match? think Cass, because the way they've been picking up the lead, like Enzo's getting like beat up and that. And they're playing off Rusev more stronger, so I'm going to go Big Cass. You're saying Big Cass? Guess what? I'll say Big Cass then as well. So, that's that. Now yeah. we move on to the proper pay per view. So, this is the start of that robot. Do you want to go for like, um, start from bottom to top and again? That's what we yes, did. We'll leave the woman, we'll leave the woman's, we'll leave the woman's then in universal, you know what I mean? So, universal the last. So, then we'll put like, you know, for sure, for several months, we'll do that. Yeah, yeah. So. Alright. Alright. Oh my god. A tag team match for the WWE Raw Tag Team Championships. It is the New Deer, which is either Big E or Kofi Kingston or Xavier Wood, versus Sheamus and Cesaro. Right, this is twice at the face and now, and um, to be honest with you, I do want those titles to actually change hands. So Cesaro and Sheamus will be good. Well, past the, the, past the streak there, so I need another to use them. So Cesaro and Sheamus for me. Are you saying the same thing? Cesaro and Sheamus? Yeah. Goodbye. Good luck. Alright, six. Yes. Yeah. Goodbye. Braun Strowman versus Sami Zayn. Now, Sami Zayn actually did want, um. Yep, yeah, did want um, Braun Strowman. And, um. Big Foley. Well, he actually argued with the general manager because he wanted um, the match with Braun Strowman. But I can't believe that Mick Foley actually did say this. Like, saying, like, oh, he was actually going to trade him for Eva Marie. Can you believe it? Trading Sammy Suzanne for her? It's just terribly really funny. <laughs> yeah, it would be funny. Sammy Zayn would do great on SmackDown, would you, would you think that? He would, yeah. You know? Yeah, he would do great on SmackDown. He would work SmackDown to level but well, this is a singles match, but it's a 10 minute. So it's a 10 minute match. So it's not an Iron Man match, it's just a 10 minute match. So who would you say for that one? I would say for the bit. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Why would you not go for the big guy? No, because now then they're going to do either like the surprise big up the little guy with the big guy. That's how it works. Yeah, but I'll say Sammy Zayn for this one. Alright, next is... Is this for the Cruiserweight title? <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> Better <than God>. Rich... <laughs> Rich Swan... Um, oh, it's a triple threat match. First Rich and Swan versus TJ Bergens versus B. Brian, B. Brian Kendrick. And it's for the Cruiserweight title, so it's a triple threat match. You know what? Rich Swan, I really do like him as a champion. But I'll tell you who I also loved... I loved T.J. Perkins as a champion because he, because he, because he did it the right way. Mm -hmm. Then Brian Kendrick, like he was just all over himself, like saying, "Oh yeah, I'm the champion and all that. I got the title, but you should respect me." No, you don't do that as I'm a champion. T.J. Perkins did it the right way, and also Rich Swan did it the right way around as well because like he's been a respectful champion. Mm -hmm. Like when you're a champion, you're supposed to respect your opponents. No matter what that they do to you or anything like that. Well, no matter what they do. Well, 
far from like if they're being banned and all that, extremely bad. But I'm going to see TG Perkins is going to win this match. I'm going to <laughs> the Brian Kendrick. Yeah, uh, yeah, we'll do the E for sure for one next. Yep. Alright, next is Chris Jericho. Chris Jericho versus Seth Rollins. And I'm surprised Hardy hasn't even clicked on to something right now. What do I normally put in between Seth and Rollins? Oh, so you like funny you finally start liking him? Yeah. I'm starting to like him a little bit now. Mm-hmm. And to be t- to be honest with you, I am actually starting to like him because him and Roman Reigns is actually doing well, like for themselves, like teaming up. So we could, if um, by the draft next year, if Seth Rollins and Roman Reigns get drafted over the SmackDown, but Dean Ambrose doesn't, we could be seeing the return of the Shield. And that'll be a really good thing. That'll be a really good thing for that. But, um, for this match, I'm going to say Seth Rollins. I'll go for, sorry, I'll, the case is I'll rather go for Rollins. <laughs> you go for Seth Rollins? Yeah. We're both going for the same, guys. Next. Alright, next, the woman's title. Oh, Sasha okay. Banks versus Charlotte. Again, Jesus Christ, but this time, it's a 30-minute Iron Man match. Woman. I am woman. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I actually said, my friend. Because technically, it should be called an Iron Woman match. But that's what that in the next season. Because it's women. It's women in this. And one. Sasha and Billy have got it. So a thirty-man, not a thirty-minute Iron Woman match for the WWE Raw Women's Championship. So looks bad. I'm gonna say Sasha Banks could actually squeeze it in this one now. I've said Charlotte because I I don't like. You go the way with the strike now, yes, aren't you? The strike, no. the strike, yeah, yeah. I know I should lose it, but I'd rather prefer to lose it when she regained it. So it's been WrestleMania. Well, even, um, though, even though they've only got two hit views before WrestleMania, that's it. Right. Two. Raw Rumble, Fastlane. No, Raw Rumble, Elimination Chamber, and Fastlane. Raw. Raw. Oh, that's for Raw, Raw. Alright, for Raw. Uh, Elimination to miss Smackdowns. That's a little problem. Like two years, hours. Alright. Anyway. So, you're saying Charlotte, I'm saying Sasha Banks. For the next one. And now this one is for the main title, the WWE Kevin Universal title. Roman Cena. Kevin Owens, who is the champion, versus Roman Reigns, who was, Roman Reigns, who was also the champion, US champion. But you know, should be the Could we be seeing the first ever one where the WWE Universal title and the yes. United States title could be like both? Mm. I can't pick which because both of them have really have like um, had their title runs, but then um, but for the sake of it, I'm just gonna say Kevin Owens is gonna retain it. Kevin Owens. Are you going to be saying that? I'm going to say Roman Reigns. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you saying Roman Reigns for? I think it's Cena. It'll be Cena. John Cena's son. <laughs> oh, God. Alright. Well, this has been the last and final one that has been done. Mm-hmm. Of this year? Yeah, this year. This is the final peer per view of this year. Next year, it'll be the Royal 16 Rumble. 16 people total next year. Yeah. Next year it'll be the Royal Rumble. Next year it'll be the Royal Rumble. Next year it'll be the Royal Rumble. Wrestling. It'll be Royal Rumble. Elimination Chamber. Fastly in. Then WrestleMania. That'll be. At the minute it's looking like Payback and Extreme Rules. That'll be whatever. No bad, not Bay Bank. Payback, whichever goes with that. SummerSlam, whichever. Backlash, uh, Clash Champions, No Mercy, Hand the Cell, Summer Series, TLC, and Rumble. No. No, you forget. Right. Raw Rumble, Elimination Chamber, Fast Lane, WrestleMania, Payback, Extreme Rules. The 16 people is two uh, uh, Extreme Rules, yeah. Uh, Payback and Extreme Rules will be in the same month. The yeah, this year. yeah, that, but the big ones, that brands. Yes. Um, Money in the Bank's only in June, so there's one people in June, that, that's, big, that's big five. Yeah, so, no, wait a minute, if I pass me in time, yeah, pass me in. So, June, June that's the uh, Money in the Bank. Then you've got two people who's got Battleground and Smells. 
Battleground and Night of Champions. No, no Clash of Champions. Clash of Champions is in S- September. No, you're, you're, in, you're in July there. So you are thinking Battleground. But the case is Battleground for the second week. Yeah, remember that one. Well, there is. We don't know what it is. Alright, so. Because there, there was this year, it was only Battleground that one. We were going to pay back in Extreme Rules. It's because this year I had pay back in Extreme Rules on the same one. Yeah, could be like that. It's okay. Let's just watch that one. Anyway, this has been the WWE Robot Roblox Predictions. <laughs> Watch that. Sorry. <laughs> Roblox Predictions of um, 2016, the last and final pay per view of this year. I've been Dave 448. Thanks, Joe Cody. And. Peace! That's Lemmy's stuff. I'm going to like this or not. <laughs>